Welcome back to Tap Man Unboxing. Today is a good episode. Like I said in the title, I spent about $2,200 on these two pairs of sneakers. And I'm kind of mad that it took so long for me to buy these sneakers. Because when they did come out, I did attempt and I did sleep. But these two pairs of sneakers, I feel like they're grails, hands down. And they have to be part of any sneakerhead collection. So let's get into unboxing it. Before I get into unboxing the two shoes, please follow me on Instagram, T-A-F-F-E-M-A-N underscore. I did give a few sneak, okay, well, I kind of gave it away while I was gonna be unboxing. But if you want any more insights or any little details or what I might be unboxing in the future, just follow me on Instagram. I'll leave it in the comments below. All right, so let's get into it. So here we got the Union Ones. Yes, the Union Ones, Storm Blue. The Storm Blue Union Jordan 1 is mixed up of two OG colorways, a bread upper and a Storm Blue lower bottom. They are stitched together at the top of the shoe, located where the Air Jordan Wing logo is at. Beneath the Air Jordan Wing logo, you have the Union LA tag, and also on these shoes, the swoosh is actually in a suede new book type of material that's located the same as on the Travis Scott's. Your black toe Union Jordan 1s is mixed up of two Jordan 1s. You have the black toe bottom, and you have the gray and white upper finish. It's held together with blue stitching, and you also have your Wings logo in gray with your Union LA tag hanging right beneath the Wings logo. Just like the other Union LAs, it has that swoosh in that premium suede material. That detail is so fire. When I first got the details on the shoe, I thought they used pretty much two different shoelaces in the shoe, but you can see that they're actually two-tone. They are solid going up the shoe. And when that split do happen, the laces do change. So on the Storm Blues, you can see that it turns from like that off type of white, that bleach white into a black. And also on the black toes, you can see that it turns from that black. And when the stitches do hit, it turns to that bleach type of white. So that detail is pretty dope. Also, you have the foam like on pretty much like the off-white ones. Sock liner is actually very, very sturdy. Each Union Jordan 1 come with two extra laces. Oh, listen, if you do not have these shoes, do not play yourself. Don't. Here's my personal opinion on both sneakers. I think they're both fire. I don't have a favorite. I really don't. Because each shoe is just so tough. Like, the details of just the sneakers being stitched together, making one shoe from OG colorways, the mist, the two tone laces, even that off white vibe that they give me from a tongue, which the foam is sticking out on the tongue, just a fire shoe. It is hype because it was very limited, but even without the hype, I feel like these would have been sold out in, sold out instantly. No question about it. So if you had to ask me what my favorite one is, I couldn't tell you. Thank you for tuning in. Don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, and share this video. And in the comments below, let me know which one's your favorite, the black toe or the storm blue, because I'm having a hard time picking my favorite. Until next time, peace.